All right, let's talk about it. Zero eleven here in today. We got some news. We'll open some mail after, but we got some news. Some very unfortunate news from Upper Deck. So on Twitter, Upper Deck did an update regarding their releases. Well, let me read this. Upper Deck continues to face challenges surrounding production and supply chain management. Unfortunately, while we are going to great length to ultimately get product produced, we do not expect things to improve in any sort of meaningful capacity until mid 2022. At the earliest, we have been forced to make some difficult decisions regarding the release release calendar. With that being said, please make note of the following. 2021 Upper Deck Ice has been cancelled. 2122 Upper Deck Trilogy has been cancelled. 2122 Series 1 Hobby will release in December with retail versions likely to follow after the holidays. We still have several 2021 products that have yet to release and we'll provide updates on those when we have more clarity with regard to their release date. We apologize in advance for any inconvenience that this may cause and thank you for your patience. <laughs> See, that's really unfortunate. Ice didn't cancel. That's one of the more important sets. Some great rookies can be found in there, so to see that gone is really unfortunate. I was looking forward to Ice, but it's been pushed back so long. The last release date for it was like in February of next year. But hopefully, we see 2122 Ice. Hopefully, that'll still be a thing. They didn't say it was canceled there. They said Trilogy was canceled for 2122. Maybe they'll include some 2021 Ice cards in 2122 Ice. That's just being optimistic. Maybe they'll just cancel Ice altogether. We shall see. But it looks like Upper Deck is going to have these problems for like the next eight months, which is very concerning. We could definitely tell something's up at Upper Deck with the lack of releases. It's been waiting on procs forever. And it's even more concerning that we have 2122 procs being cancelled, so Trilogy is being cancelled. Proc that isn't necessarily a favorite. I don't mind Trilogy whatsoever, but it's unfortunate to see it get cancelled, that's for sure. And of course, Series 1 is supposed to come out first week of November, November 4th. That would have been perfect timing, but it's not coming out until December. Who knows if that'll even happen, but that'll definitely have a trickle-down effect on other releases like Series 2. Like, don't expect Series 2 to come out in February now. It's gonna come out in, like, April. And on top of that, Upper Deck did a couple of post showing release dates, hopefully release dates, for some of the upcoming products, some of which is not hockey, but HL is supposed to come out November 3rd, Platinum hopefully actually comes out November 10th, right before the expo there, I hope that comes out, Canada Junior is the 17th, that's the product that usually comes out in September, so that's not too... <clears throat> Oh. Far back from when it usually comes out. Series 1, early December. MVP December, a product that comes out in like August usually. Ultimate Collection, mid-December. That's one of the big sets, the Shield set. We actually see it mid-December, but there's just too many products in December if you look at it. Stature and Premiere, late December. Like, what is the likelihood of seeing all those products in one month? I really hope it happens. I really hope Upper Deck can figure this out and get those products out, but I doubt we see all those out in December. January looks solid. We got Goodwin Champions, which is a multi-sport thing. That's January. OPG, 21-22, usually comes out in September, right? A month before the season. That's coming out in January. 2021 SPA, the product that we've all been waiting for, let's be real. That's coming out in January. Hopefully it does come out in January. The initial release for that was September 1st, so it's been quite a while. And then you got some other miscellaneous releases there, but yeah. Not good news from Upper Deck. Canceling a long-running product like Ice is just not good. You know Ice was inserted in other products for a few years in the early 2010s there, but so maybe they'll do something like that for Ice, because I still want to see the Ice premieres of the top rookies from 2021, at least, right? You know somebody took a lot of time designing that set. So. so I just felt like sharing that. What do you guys think about that? Tim's is still greenlit, so still good to go next week for Tim's, but definitely concerning. So yeah, let's talk about some We just got one package. It's a big package here from July. There's a repeat center, Wolf Cappy. So we'll see what he has in store here. All right. Hey, Ziri. Wolf Cappy here, and today I sent you a product that you've never opened on the channel, and I know has never been opened on YouTube ever before, okay? I've been a massive fan of the channel for years now. Not quite the gaming days, but close. Good. No, we need to see those gaming videos. I wanted to send you this package as a token of appreciation, not just for me, but from everyone on Team Zeri. To do what you've done do takes a ton of dedication, hard work, and patience. We all know it can't be easy on the wallet. Yeah. We're all thankful that you put yourself out there for us. You do an amazing job, sir. You're the hockey card chosen. <laughs> Appreciate that. A lot of sacrifices have been made, I'll tell you that. But you're a huge inspiration for me to start my own hockey card channel. Wolf Cappy Hockey Cards. Go check them out right there. Wolf Cappy Hockey Cards. Which has been an unbelievable experience so far. This community is amazing. I actually messaged you last September for advice before starting, and your words paid off. I don't remember what I said, but K. I've crossed the 1,000 sub mark. Nice. And hope to hit 2K by Wolf Cappy's one year anniversary, November 12th. I mean, it's coming up. Let's get Wolf Cappy to 2K there. But, uh, I constantly run sealed proc giveaways if you want to check it out. Alright. Sorry for the novel. <laughs> Not too bad. I've had far longer notes. Enjoy the opening. P.S. There's a note on the back of the puzzle. Thanks for everything, Wolf Cappy. Alright, Wolf Cappy. Let's see what you sent. Alright, let's open this first here, and then we have a 
big thing to open last. Looks like a binder. Uh, what the heck is this? Ooh. Oh my god. Uh, we got the Ziri Gaming Hobby Box. 12 packs per box, 9 cards per pack. With Uncle Todd there, the logo there. We got Josh Hosang on the side there. We got Heater there. Oh my god. Sean Avery, get out of the bike lane. Wow. There you go. That's awesome right there. Let's see what's in store here from Wolf Cappy. We got 12 packs. A lot of packs here. Bonus card. Hope this isn't too cringe, but I made a custom YouTube mem card and wanted you to have it since you inspired me to open on YouTube. And the set means a lot to you. Okay. Oh, and there's something there as well, but let's check out this here. All right. Okay. Authentic video use pack auto. We got Wolf Cappy signature on 0708 series 2. Good set right there. Great set right there. So episode 47. <laughs> Interesting there. I actually put that with the custom cards there. Wolf Cappy's autograph. Nice. Other bonus. Here's a scan card to go to my channel. So let's just, there you go. Hopefully that actually works and it doesn't lead to something questionable, but there you go. Go check out Wolf Cappy. That's funny. But let's open first right here. Zero gaming here. I got to rebrand. I know I do. Ah, I'm going to have to frick this up. That's not good. got to preserve at least one of these, but oh, full on custom cards here. Ah, uh, Uncle Todd. Oh my gosh. Ice Dogs. Carter Verhage and the Wolf Cappy. The London Knights guy, right? Verhage. Nice. Right there. Dog years 2011 to 15. Was it say on the back Uncle Todd there? I don't want to take too long. It's going to take way too long there, but there you go. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh. These are awesome right there. Oh, me pulling the cup card. There you go. January 7th, 2018. Jeez, almost four years now, but there you go. Oh, we got a Rask card there. <laughs> There you go, there's a rasp. Roll, Leaf, Tormentor. And playing the saxophone. Okay. <laughs> Best pals at Walmart. Yes, I'm gonna have this in the background when I open stuff from Walmart. That's perfect right there. Roll back prices. I think I I think I speak for everyone I say. I actually have no idea if Ziri is being serious or joking every time he says he shoplifts from his best pals at Walmart. He is unbelievably educated in strategies and knows his way around the beeping things better than anyone this world has ever seen in the hockey card department. Now they're never stocked. And uh, you'll never know that answer, but what the heck is this? Oh, yeah, there you go. That's the hot prospects. That was 2019 there. Pulled the redemption. That was devastating there. But... Wow, there you go. These are awesome. Oh, my gosh. Oh, artifact. One, two, and three. Okay. Oh, hold the Marner. Don't have that Marner. I actually sold that Marner to my brother for 150 bucks. Because I have the inscribed in black. But, yeah, it's questionable on my behalf there. But a little thing there, huh? And then a heater face there. That's awesome. Holy crap. Oh, my gosh. I gotta do it right. Mmm, Evgeny. Kuznets. I was watching the Caps game last night and Kuzi scored and did it. I just had to laugh, but there's a Kuzi doing the bird clown with the coke. Ah, oh, these cards are awesome. Oh, there's a Sid Pull right there from SBA. Uh, Ed Belfour. Eddie the Eagle there. I'm on the block cucks here. Nice. There you go. Uh, Luca Caputi. More Ice Dog stuff there. That's nice there. The only guy that did Ice Dog and be a Leaf. I'm hoping for a certain guy that's on the Marlies right now to change that, but there you go. <laughs> Rasmus Dali. Yeah, I'll do it. There you go. <laughs> There you go. Oh my gosh. Oh, the Igor Larianov one of one. Sold that card questionably. There you go. That was a nice pull from Crown Royal there back when that stuff was 70 bucks a box. There's a daddy there. He's on Vegas now. <laughs> Roll father. I'm definitely have to go through these later on, but jeez. <laughs> Frick right off. Oh my gosh. Juleson. And then we got Briz Galoff, Afraid of Bears. Wow. All right, next pack up here from the Ziri Gaming Hobby Box from Wolf Cappy. Okay, everybody's favorite aunt, Auntie Niemi. Second favorite aunt, Auntie Ranta. Oh, the Suzuki high gloss. I actually got 1500 bucks for that card. So yeah, I sold it. But there you go. That's a nice card. There's more artifact stuff there. Got Cujo right there. There you go. Alex Petrangelo. Nice. Right there. Then we got the triple booklet. I also sold that card. But that's a sick card right there. Legends of the NHL. These are cool cards. A little retrospective there. And 12-13 score. Garbage. Yep. Ah, there he is. Angry Canes guy. <laughs> that's funny there. Oh my god. Brett Ritchie. Yeah, he's on the Calgary Flames now. There's Ritchie. Him and Strong. Rome were quite the duel for the Ice Dogs there, but Richie, ah, uh, Carey Price, there you go, that was a nice pull there. There's Patrick Kane, awesome there, ugh, why is this in here? Neil Poirier, the 15-16 SBA, and jeez, prize possessions, future watch collection. It has, uh, some of my nicer future watches there, <laughs> you definitely gonna have a feeling there, but yeah, very cool there. Uncle Todd pull, biggest pulls, <laughs> that's funny there. Oh, there's Jason Robertson, the OHL scoring champ there, but there you go, nice brief time with the Ice Dogs there, and <laughs> Frickin' Alfie. Okay, next up here. Oh my. Frick. 
fucking face looking right big rad there. Oh, the Aho. Jeez. A lot of these cards I don't have anymore, but there's the Aho RPA from 2017. Jeez. Long time ago there. <laughs> Scott Foster. That's nice. Little guy's rookie. A marquee rookie black bar there, but there you go. There's uh, Freddie Hamilton. Nice. Freddie Hamilton. Older brother of Dougie there. Oh, the Brady Kachuk RPA. Another card I don't have. Light. 2019. Ah, these are awesome. Diggy. J.S. Shiger. Very nice there. Oh, Laughing Year Canvas. I don't have. By the way, I forgot to mention. Literally have them right here. I was gonna say, but yeah, this is listed. That's listed. That's listed. If guys are interested, check out eBay. Yeah, I just have them up on eBay. I'm willing to negotiate, but I was laughing your camera a year ago. <laughs> Louis Erickson. Oh, uh, jeez. And then <clears throat> we got gritty there. <laughs> okay. It me. There you go. Demon mascot. <laughs> a lot of packs there. All right, Matt Sundin. Nice. There you go. I am Elise uh, there, so Matt Sundin. Ah, Elias or James there. That was quite the pull there. Really enjoyed that series. I mean, that was like 150 bucks a box, which is very solid, but Dougie, there he is. Ice Dogs. There you go. There's Dougie Hamilton. There's that. Oh, <laughs> right there. Still hasn't officially retired. More artifacts. <laughs> Runs over cards with car and sets cards on fire. Oh my God. Gosh. Okay. Uh, prize possession. Phil Kessel, day with the cup from Andrew. Yeah. Oh my gosh. This must have taken you a really long time, Wolf Cappy. Jeez. Oh my gosh. There's Carter Hart. Nice. There's a Sid from the Master Case, right? Yeah. Yeah, that was towards the very end of that case right there. There you go. I had a little reaction there. That's funny. And then Mitch Marner. These are awesome. Nephew Tyler. Jeez. Legend nephew. There you go. Oh, the Joe Sackett. Jeez. Another card I don't have. I should make a video. Cards I used to own. Be a pretty nice list. There you go. Joe Sackett. Silver Skate Old Auto there. That was four years ago. Geez. There's that. Hey, Jamie Alexiak. Seattle Kraken briefly played for the Ice Dogs there, but the rental. Him and Dougie were like the pairing one when they went to the finals against the London Knights, but there you go. There's Ron. <laughs> There. Hugger of nuts. Artifacts for, I don't know if there's gonna be a proper artifact six ever. Maybe there will be. I need explosives, okay? I need to step it up here. Need more than fire. Lights bonfire. Uh, there you go, John Scott. That's nice there. All star. All star MVP there. Nickname All Star Roll All Star. Uh, biggest poll. Map relics. Same tire. Jeez. April 9th there. Uh, Vince Dunn. Another Seattle crack in there. There's Dunn. There you go. That's cool. And Alexander. Summon. <laughs> oh my god, you have a picture on the back. Him slapping Mark Stahl, right? Uh, apparently, according to LeapProspects.com, it's spelled Soyomin now. Okay. All right, next up here, we got <laughs> Sean Avery. Oh my god. Get out of the bike. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Uh, that's perfect right there. Bike cop. Streets of New York to protect bike lanes from what he describes as. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Absolute hero right there. Oh, there you go. Biggest pulls. C channel 2008. Yeah, that was like a blaster box back in 08 there. But Jonathan Tay's young guns there. There's three boss there. Still lurking there. Free channel pull 2008. That was also 2008. I actually pulled Kane after Tay's, but both were in 08. There you go. That's very cool right there. Yeah, there's Brendan Perlini. He's on the Oilers now. He semi resurrected his career. Went over to Europe for a year. Now he's back in the NHL. So that's good for him there. Perlini, I'm sitting on so many Perlini cards. Geez. Still looking for that green button. Morgan Riley, probably gonna lose him. Free agency coming up here, unless the Leafs do something drastic, but there's Riley. I mean, the market for defensemen is absolutely crazy right now. Probably gonna want like 9 million bucks. Oh, we got some Rasmussen. At least he's playing this year. Constantly pulling bad FWA doubles. Rasmussen isn't terrible, but yeah, it's not great. But there you go. Heart <laughs> Heartbreaks literally all the time. Yeah. Still never pulled him a car. A fart noise. Okay. Jack Stanika, another player that played briefly for the Ice Dogs there. There you go. So that's interesting there. <laughs> Take those pads off. Arters are... Look at how greasy they are in that picture. Jeez. Him running over Elias? Yeah, okay. All right, four more packs here from Wolf Cappy. Jeez, this is going to be an exceptionally long video. Probably should have started recording this several hours before I started. This might be up in the middle of the night. So, yeah. Dustin Penner and there's pancakes there. Oh my gosh. Getting injured, making pancakes. Ah, oh, these are awesome. Oh, Mitch Marner there. Wasn't even that exciting when I pulled him out. I guess it's expected when you're opening a case. I did have a case of 1617 series there. Ah, Josh Hosang. There you go. There's him after he scored a goal. Electrifying elite talent, Josh Hosang. He'll be up with the Leafs in no time, but there you go. Austin Matthews. Gotta have Matthews there. Mustachioed sniper. Okay. That uh, freaking Noah Juleson there. Back in 2019. There's Patrick Waugh. St. Patrick there. Uh, the McDavid from Ultimate there. Hopefully, the Ultimate hopefully comes out in December. I can get a nice pull like that, but that was a really nice pull there. Still have that current. Don't plan on ever getting rid of it. Andrew Agazino. Nice. Uh, probably the greatest ice dog of all time. 
time there. Captain, 2007-2012, uh, he's part of the Sens now, depth guy for the Sens. He's a quality depth player. And Ilya Mikheyev, who's unfortunately injured once again, but there's Mikheyev. Okay, next up here. There's Phil on the range with the hot dogs in the cup there. Oh my gosh, that picture there. Jeez. Oh, there you go. Another nice poll there. McKinnon Young Guns. Don't have a McKinnon Young Guns anymore. 2018. Yeah, it was a little like mini series I did there. There's Alex Nedeljkovic. That's cool there. There he is there. There's Willie. William Nylander. Oh, there's another heart breaks. The rounded corner Lafreniere. Yeah. Yuri Tulusti. <laughs> Rated R. Not so PG things. There you go. Oh, another nice poll here. Tim Stutzla. Questionable Photoshop there, but Stutzla there. Alex Friesen. Nice. And Metal Thrower. Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, my gosh. This must have taken a really long time. Oh, my gosh. Jeez. Okay. We got two more left. So this is the second last one. There's Tomer. Right there. Okay. And the Devils now. Oh, this card, which I've since sold. It's in a good home now, though. But I've since sold the Wierenski patch, questionably. That's a really nice card. But I got a fair offer for it. Somebody collects him, so. Sold it. But there you go. Andrew Shaw. There he is. Fan favorite there. He's retired now because of concussions. But there's Shaw. Nice. Uh, get this out of here. <laughs> Why? Yeah. There you go. David Ayers. Is Zamboni down there. Oh, these are too much. Jeez. There's David Ayers. Okay. Uh, more artifacts. Weed Whacker entrance. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Beeping thing has its own card. Okay, I gotta put that with the Walmart. And I uh, do another Walmart video there. Jeez. Oh, the Leafs booklet. There's a card that I'm definitely never getting rid of right there. Six way there. Original six. All goalies at six. There's tag. Sun tag. Yeah. See if anything happens with him, but there you go. And uh, Ryan Strom. Currently injured right now, but should be back soon for the Rangers. Oh, yeah. Awesome. And the final thing here, and then we have that big thing reveal there, but wow, these are amazing. I gotta case all of these up. Jeez. These are fantastic. Okay. Note on card seven. Oh, okay, it's a puzzle. So let's see if we can find the note here. Oh, here we go. Hey, Ziri, on behalf of all Ziri fans, this tribute set is a thank you for all the hard work you've done and fun you've given to the masses and this hobby. If it weren't for you, thousands wouldn't get to experience breaking all of these products from low end to the high. On a personal level. When you open cards, we all cheer for you. We're all on Team Ziri. The wins are our wins. Thank you for creating this community and helping grow the hobby. From Wolf Cappy and Team Ziri. That's awesome awesome right there but let's uh see if i can put together this puzzle here so there it is that's awesome right there makes this giant collage of things oh that's fantastic right there oh jeez walmart freaking brad there wow that is awesome oh on the back here has like the list of all the cards there too that's really cool there but the final thing from wolf cap you open last oh my gosh there it is once again i guess i know where i'm putting the cards i'll put them all in here oh my gosh that is sick but you got <laughs> uncle don here on the front there that is awesome if i ever did a rebrand having a banner similar to this that That'd be pretty cool, but that's awesome right there. Very cool right there. Oh my gosh. So Wolf Cappy. Jeez. Just absolutely amazing. I couldn't imagine how long it took you to put this all together. That is ah uh, fantastic. Ah. Uh, just absolutely amazing. Go check out Wolf Cappy. Get him to 2,000 subs. Unbelievable package. Wow. So there's <laughs> Yeah, guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.